believe that the documentary actually is going to be filling a very important gap in our um, society, uh, British society here, uh, because um, especially for for um, uh, Muslim uh, generations here living in this country, um, they need to find out, they need to explore as to how to contribute towards their wider community, and that is the way how Islam should have been so far. And um, I think the Gulen's um, idea is that. You need to serve your community to be part of that community, and it is very important. It is actually the essential value in his understanding. And I, I believe there is so much that we need to learn. Many of the times, um, um, the Muslim youth in this country and the generations, um, they feel Islam as a reactionary movement uh, most of the time. However, it is actually contributory, and it is actually a positive and constructive approach um, towards making the society better. And uh, I wish that this movie is actually um, shown um, to a wide a range of audience, uh, and uh, they actually they may actually interpret it in their own ways, but I, I believe definitely it will be a positive one. What is um, the most striking about, especially the movement that that is actually shown, and that is the people's commitment, and um, at the center of um, movement as it as is um, documented um, in this film is that um, people are um, inspired by their faith and they commit themselves um, to serve people so that they actually gain the pleasure of God regardless of their creed or their race. I think it is a, it is a very important thing and many of the times there is, there is a kind of um, um, distinct line between being an extremist but you can actually be destructive. But in this one, you are actually e extremely committed and you actually use this commitment to construct something better for the community. I think that is put forward very well in this film. Personal stories could have been, um, like some of them were actually better than others. Um, they don't, um, I felt that I needed to know more about these people's backgrounds for, for, for me to, um, for me to um, establish a link with them. Because sometimes um, uh, for me to be able to understand their motives, um, I need to understand what they were and then, and then once they choose to um, contribute towards his med activities, then what changed them and so on. I think that should have been probably portrayed better. What I see is that the Hizmet's activities have been um, um, very uh, productive so far, however limited and little known about them, uh, especially in this country. And I think um, people they need to be um, more aware of it to me that, uh, that there is so much that we can actually learn from this perspective. Um, and um, I think it, it, like, there are lots of lessons that we can actually adopt, um, learn from this one. And also from um, um, for people of his met, uh, they need to um, they need to be able to um, express it um, in a in a in a better way and probably a more um, consolidated in such a way that the people the wider audience can actually understand what they're actually saying because many of the times they seem to come out of their own personal circumstances and their own um, they are they are. Um, um, concentrated in their in their mission, and not so much concentrated in their effort to explain what they are about and what they want to achieve with it. And there is it's not very clear about what they want to establish with it. Uh, I think that it will have to be elaborated maybe for the second part uh, of this movie.